Good afternoon, guys. God bless you. Carlos here with Serrano's Mobile Detail here in Dallas, Texas. Thank you so much for watching today's video. So, today's video, I have been very busy this whole month, so I do apologize. I really haven't been making a lot of videos, um, but finally the month is almost over, giving me a little bit of leniency and some time to do uh, a product review. What we're going to be reviewing today is the CMX uh, Surface Prep Spray, which I have really enjoyed readily available at your local walmart um and this is made by mothers um mothers they've they've been out for a while um and i mean i've never had any issues with their products that i've used um so i've been <coughs> i've been eyeing this one for quite some time walked through the walmart aisles um but i never purchased it and finally i purchased it i think i'm going on i'd say a good about three weeks playing with this product just to kind of get a good idea of it this one here i think cost around like ten dollars like ten or eleven dollars at walmart um for the price and the availability this is at i i i really enjoy it the odor the odor on this smells kind of like like blueberries i don't i don't know call me crazy um uh, but very easy and you're gonna be seeing me applying this on this window here um, on this next clip as I'm talking about the product um, this is a pH neutral product you can use it on glass uh, you can use it on paint you can use it on plastic on trims wheels um, so this is an all-around really really good product uh, you know at the end of the day I think many of us are gonna be using whatever works best right so I've always used duplicate color grease and wax remover and I and I will always use it um, but for this a uh, couple of weeks i've been kind of using this just to see how well it performs um and i really like it you know i do it inside my garage so it's cool spray wipe flashes and leaves <coughs> no residue no streaking behind um so for that i really enjoy this product so uh, just like anything you prep your your areas really well i always do two times of a of a prep spray just to make sure i get all the polishes sealants or claying and or all of that so um i for me to be comfortable i do two times prep so after i come and do the whole car i'll literally come back and spray it again um so it does really well as you're gonna see on this video here very soon we're gonna be talking to, well i'm gonna bring you guys up close and see how well the um the product performs so this next product i want to talk about guys is actually their mother's mother's uh ceramic spray coating this is a sio2 tio2 it's uh titanium uh particles in here as well and sio2 um as well so silicon dioxide and titanium dioxide it does a really really good smells good um one issue i do see with this though is it tends to make the areas like um white after you spray it um, if you don't wipe it off, it creates like, well, like it looks like overspray. And let me just bring you guys in really quick so you can kind of see. I let this dry for about six hours. So I don't know if you guys can see this right here. After you spray it, it creates these white little dust. Um, so don't panic if you see that on your vehicle. Literally, just grab your towel and it comes right off. So. That was the only thing I kind of didn't like about the product. At first, I thought I had stained it. But as you guys can see, you can literally just wipe it off. And it comes right off. So for that, you know, my, some may say, oh, that's not good. But, you know, for me, it didn't take a lot to just remove it off. So, you know, I just wanted to show you guys and be transparent of what this product does now how well does the product perform to be honest i don't have an estimate as to the durability on this because i've never really used it um but i hope i can get at least i say a good three months out of it um i clayed clayed um clayed prepped and then i applied this ceramic spray coating <laughs> if you're working with vehicles um this is really good i think for people that um are maintenancing coated vehicles for one 
uh, two of you are a do-it-yourself person and are looking for a product where readily available and it's gonna do really really good I think this is a really good product I think this one was like $13 uh, at Walmart and it's a really really good product overall in my opinion now I don't do a lot of product testing and stuff like that I literally I'll try it on my cars and see what I think about it so I'll kind of keep you guys updated on the durability um, but this is a really really just simple it's a very simple spray on wipe off type of product um, it gives you that deep glass like ultra durable finish super hydrophobic <coughs> and literally like it says just simply spray on and wipe off coat like a pro you can also literally this if you're a do-it-yourself person that you just like to maintain your cars every other week this is a really really good product to just go and buy all right yes there are many other great products out there that you can buy um <coughs> the cost is going to be a little bit greater but hey you know at the end of the day hopefully i'll showcase more of those products so on this next clip or this next video i want to show you guys how well this product performs we're going to hit it with some water and let's see how it reacts so stay tuned for that Alrighty guys, so what I'm going to be using is obviously my Marilex 2000 with just water um, on here. So this is the uh, area that I uh, I actually did both windows, but you guys saw on the little clip, it was this window here that I uh, clean and use the uh, prep spray as well as their spray coating. Um, so let's see how it performs and we'll go from there. Here we go. All right, as you guys can see, the product is very, very hydrophobic. Very hydrophobic. As you, here's, here's the paint. It's very flat. So that's just an example. It'll kind of give you guys of, I guess, how my paint is. But here we go again to the window. Very, very hydrophobic, guys. Look at that. So. We'll see how long this kind of uh, maintains itself. But overall, you got some nice beads. Nice beading going on on the window. You can also use this product, the, your uh, spray coating on the paint. You can use it on plastic. Just to kind of give it that maintain, uh, maintenance. But that is pretty good. And I also did this window right here. Look at that. Really, really nice. Well, all right, let me back this camera up and we'll bring you guys in and uh, kind of do some final thoughts on it and uh, give me your opinions on this. All righty guys, so overall, uh, the CMX ceramic spray coating and their surface prep, what do I think about it? Overall, I really can't make any complaints on these two products so far obviously um i think they're very new to the market i don't see a lot of videos on this product um but if you've seen it or if you've even tried it let me know what you guys think on the comments um i think really good products as you guys can see on the windows how well it just beaded everything uh, i really enjoyed these two i've been playing with these um so i hope you guys enjoyed this video um very soon i'll be actually bringing you guys in on another product review their cmx ceramic coating this one here i am still playing with it um, i don't want to make a review on this till i really know exactly what i'm working with how it works how i can use it and what scenarios but after reading this product it has a lot of good good things obviously um, but we'll know more in the next couple of weeks how I like it, how it performs. Um, and <coughs> I'll be able to guys give you a more honest and in-depth review with this product. I am still playing with it. Um, I was gonna talk about it today, but I just don't feel very confident yet on the product um, because I really been, just been playing with it myself. Um, but anyways, happy Saturday guys. I hope you guys have a blessed Saturday. Um, again, thank you so much for watching today's video. Uh, and thank you for your patience. I know some of you guys have asked for some videos and I just haven't had a lot of time. I have been very busy. Um, but overall, I hope you guys have a blessed Saturday. God bless you and y'all have a great Sunday. See you next time.